Do you get upset when you hear about harsh horse bits and wish you knew how to help? In this video, we at Bits and Spurs will show you 9 disturbing horse bits that are so harsh they should be illegal. Plus, offer a way to help. Check out bitsandspurs.org for a closer look at the Western lifestyle. Number 1. The O-Ring Snaffle Bit with Spikes This bit's design, commonly used in India, is unfortunately as harsh as it sounds. These sharp spikes dig into the horse's mouth in an overzealous effort to train the horse. Number 2. The Three Bar Bit Traditionally crafted in German silver, the design of this bit is not to be sharp, but to prevent the horse from sticking its tongue out. Number 3. The chain bit with rings. The reins are attached to any of the rings, and the lower the ring, the more intense the pain for the horse. Number 4. The mule mouth bit. This nickel-plated draft horse ring bit has a 6-inch mule mouth and can be reversed from severe to mild. The jointed ends allow rings to swivel in and out. Number 5. The O-ring with twisted mouthpiece and chain bit. This bit's twisted mouthpiece design exerts additional pressure on the horse's tongue and bars. The chain on the other hand, adds a sharp edge, causing even more distress. Number 6. The Norton Bit or Citation Bit. This has a double mouthpiece that applies intense pressure. Rain shortening causes a double scissor action in the mouth for added palate pressure. Number 7. The Gag Bit. This contraption is designed to lift the horse's head when it leans too much on the bit. The gag bit slides through the mouth when pulled. Number 8. A chain bit combo. The chain links, when pulled, create a big pinch in the horse's mouth. Finally, this five-ring elevator device that has a stud chain for a mouthpiece. This bit is a bizarre blend of design elements resembling a figure eight, flash, drop noseband combo, but with an unnerving twist, spikes. We're not totally sure what this is or what it's for, but it looks like a torture device. If you're upset about this, we get it, we are too. So we started researching solutions, while we were hard-pressed to find any organizations trying to help these horses from America, we did find one that is helping horses in India. And the best part is they take donated horse bits from anywhere in the world. Once they collect donated bit, they distribute them to the Indian locals as a replacement for harsher and handmade bits. In India, homemade snaffle bits are common and often cause pain and injury. With partnerships formed with influential Indian horse enthusiasts, Friends of Marwari.org has made their goal clear, to promote kinder, more informed horsemanship. They believe that by introducing more conventional bits, they can make a significant difference in the well-being of these majestic creatures. Their mission is to spread kindness, one bit at a time. Click the link below for more on this organization. As we've seen, there are many types of horse bits that should be illegal. It's crucial that we prioritize more humane and safe equipment for our horses, Let's not forget Friends of Marwari's inspiring efforts in India to replace harmful bits with safer alternatives. Make sure to comment your thoughts on this and share with someone who would care. Check out bitsandspurs.org for a closer look at the Western lifestyle, packed with insider tips, trends, and inspiration.